You are welcome to Flip TV News. My name is Victor Adai. First, the headlines. Bob Risky speaks on bribing EFCC serving jail time in the house. Governor Lawa, General Busao know about banditry in Zamfara, says Matawali. Now the news in full. Ibris Okuneye, popularly known as Bob Risky, has reacted to the allegations contained in a voice note released by Martins Oti, also known as the very dark man, that he bribed the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission with 15 million naira and served a six month jail term in an apartment and not a correctional center. The reaction of the controversial cross-dresser came after the very dark man released the audio that sounded every bit like Bob Risky. In an uncoordinated response in very terrible English, Bob Risky wrote on his Instagram page in the early hours of Wednesday, my attention has been drawn to a fake voice recording circulating on the internet that I paid EFCC 15 million naira and that I was never in prison. I did not pay any EFCC money. I did not pay any EFCC money is a very big lie. I served my time in full and I came out. Discard any false information. In a follow-up to the earlier response, Bobriski added, Imagine believing someone that came out publicly to tell us that you paid a hacker to track someone's phone, which is against the law, can be desperate to do anything at this point. I didn't give EFCC any money. I made a mistake typo in write-up. As earlier reported by as earlier reported in the voice note, Bob Risky was asking that he is not sitting in prison for over four months, was facilitated by a top government official. In the voice note made available on Instagram, the cross gesture recorded during a telephone conversation said a top officer of the Nigerian Correctional Center facilitated the deal. Also in the voice note, he said that he bribed officials of the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission with 50 million to ensure that the aspect of money laundering and the charges against him were dropped. He listed some of those who helped in facilitating the funds for the bribe. In another twist, Bob Risky also alleged that his early release from prison was facilitated by Falan and Falano, popularly known as Faust, a bad guy. He said in a voice note that Faust enlisted the support of his father, Femi Falano, senior advocate of Nigeria, who made necessary and right contacts to get him out early. He alleged that Falano was paid 10 million naira for his efforts. The FCC has since summoned both the very dark man and Bob Risky. The spokesman of the anti graft against the Daily Oyewale announced this in a statement he issued late on Tuesday. Oyewale said the agency's chairman Ola Olukoyedi has constituted a panel to probe the revolution. Governor Lawa, General Gusau, know about banditry in Samvara State, says Matawali. The Minister of State for Defense, Belo Matawali, has said that the Governor of Zamfara State, Daudu Lawa, and General Ali Gusau are privy to the activities of bandits in the state. He spoke following the accusation by Lawa that he housed bandits in the government's house and paid them while he was governor. Matawali, who spoke on Chinese television program Sunrise Daily, challenged Governor Lawa and General Gusau to swear by the Quran if his accusation was a lie. He said, It was not only that I that dialogue it was only not only i that dialogue with bandits remember the governor's dialogue to the then governor of Nigeria and sokoto state did the same who only why only me because it is samfara samfara is a very complex state with terrible human beings with devilish ideas let me remind you i was the only governor that swore to the only quran that i have no hand or connection with banditry or i am not happy with what is happening that if i am happy or if i am part of it or if I know those doing it, or if I am collaborating with them, God should not give me one second chance. I challenged all politicians, including General Ali Gusau and Daudu, Daudu Alawa, to do the same. None of them could take the oath, and if they don't take the oath, that means they are part. That will be all on our news update. Join us for more stories on our channels, Flip TV, Flip TV Plus. My name is Victor Ajayi.